I'm new this morning, the nonprofit organization that's helping get drug addicts off the streets and into rehab is coming back to Albuquerque. Action 7 News reporter Angela Brower first told you about Last Chance Intervention just a few months ago. So, Angela, why did they decide to return here? Well, Marissa, when we did this story back in May, that group told us that Albuquerque was the worst drug ridden city they'd ever seen. And they swore to us that they would be coming back to help more people get into rehab. Well, this morning, Action 7 News has learned, like you said, that they are in fact coming back this weekend. The men who run Last Chance Intervention can't help but have a heart for Albuquerque. How can we help this community? The nonprofit group travels the country helping drug addicts heal by funding their full recovery. I need help. When LCI was here back in May, they took two desperate New Mexicans into their program. <laughs> We're told they are now two months sober and going strong. There's a lot of gratitude. And a lot of need. Since then, LCI has gotten phone calls and letters daily asking for the same help. The group has now place more than a dozen people from the land of enchantment into detox and rehab, but they want to do more. You guys have a serious drug problem there. They are returning this weekend to take at least two more drug addicts off our streets and get them sober. Now, the space for LCI is limited, but they tell us they are, in fact, still taking names. If you know anybody or even if you yourself needs help, they are more than willing to at least reach out. We're going to explain that process and also how you, as a community member, can help support this cause coming up this weekend. Stay tuned. We'll have all of that information coming up in the next half hour. Reporting live from Southeast Albuquerque this morning, I'm Angela Brower, KOT Action 7 News. More in the morning.